Seismic imaging, sometimes called reflection seismology, is an exploration method that estimates the seismic characteristics of the Earth's subsurface. The technology measures reflected acoustic energy waves and is mostly used for coal, oil and gas and geothermal exploration. Seismic imaging provides geophysicists and geologists a method of mapping the subsurface structure of rock formations. Geophysicists and geologists interpret the data to map structural features that could potentially contain minerals, hydrocarbons or hot rock resources. The Earth's upper crust is composed of many layers of rocks and minerals that all have different properties such as hardness, density and porosity. The placement and orientation of these layers give clues as to the likelihood of finding mineral, hydrocarbon or hot rock reserves nested within them. Changes in properties between different rocks can cause reflection and or refraction of sound waves. Seismic imaging works by sending acoustic energy waves created from a sound source through these layers and then recording how long a reflected sound wave took to be received by a microphone. This data tells geophysicists and geologists where rock properties change, thus helping find oil and gas deposits. Typically, there are two methods for producing the source sound waves. One is by using a vibrosize and the other is by using an explosive detonation. A vibrosize is also known as a thumper or a shaker unit. It is a large hydraulic ram that is fitted to a special truck. The operator stops the truck at a location where they would like to generate a signal and uses the vibrosize to ram the ground, thus creating a series of source waves. Microphones, called geophones, that have been specially placed in an array around the survey area pick up the reflected sound waves and record that data to a digital medium for later computer analysis. Sometimes, instead of using a vibrosize, explorers will use an explosive like dynamite to create the source wave. Explosives are placed beneath the earth in shallow drill holes. When the explosives are detonated, an acoustic shock wave travels through the ground and is detected by an array of geophones that have been previously arranged. Because scientists know how long it takes for sound waves to travel through and bounce back from different types of rocks and minerals, careful interpretation of seismic data can give geophysicists and geologists detailed cross-sections and three-dimensional graphics of the subsurface of a surveyed area. This can help them find mineral, hydrocarbon and hot rock resource deposits.